Welcome to Creative Living for Dancers, where we dive into the world of freelance dance. My name is Brianna, and today we will be looking at the five reasons you may be struggling as a freelance dance artist. Stay tuned. From Michigan to Belgium, I never imagined taking my dance career internationally. Others said it wouldn't be worth it, but I'd say it's the best decision I ever made. Join me as we dive into living fully and unapologetically as full-time freelance dancers. Second reason that you might be struggling as a freelance dance artist is you might not be making enough money. Um, the money conversation is always a really tough one to have. And typically the first thing that I start with is how is your approach when it comes to making and or using your money? Do you just see money as a means of kind of just transaction making things happen? Or is everything you're doing an investment? Is the money you're making being used in a certain way? Are you also doing the work that allows you to make enough for what you need for your particular life or lifestyle? I say you have to approach your career, especially as a freelancer in a way, in a very creative way to make your money work for you and not the other way around. If you have more questions about making money as a freelancer, I recommend my video on five ways to make more money as a freelance dance artist. Thanks so much for watching the introduction video of the five reasons you may be struggling as a freelance dance artist. Now go ahead and head on over to creativelivingfordancers.com and check out the full video. See you there.